Ah, another beautiful day in downtown Riverside. Beautiful palm trees. Big blue sky. Busy streets filled with cars. And last but not least, your friendly neighborhood pedestrians walking on the sidewalk. There's none good. There's none good but one. There's none good but one. Are you a good man? Falling angels is for hell. You don't want to go there. I want every kid. You're going to burn an eternal fire. To look over here. You're going to burn an eternal fire. She sits upon the waters on a scarlet color piece. The wine of fornication, yeah, for everyone to drink. Harlot of abomination, blood of mortars on the street. Golden cup has run its over, fill her double to defeat. Though they be of one mind, it's destruction to the kings. Making war with the lamb, but the lion is the sheep. When the chariots are overhead, it's running in hysteria. The king of kings and lord of lords is coming to America. Prepare slaughter for those that not reign in one hour. That information was read, then black Latinos and Native Americans would piece together information. Okay. And no one asked that question, right? Why do you use the word hell when you... What do you mean? Why do you curse? When you Am I sinning? When you say hell. Am I sinning? Well, we'll talk you're, about you're not using Am I sinning? the word of God. According to who? Jesus Christ. Show me in the Bible where Christ says I can't use the word hell. Which well, is used over use and over and Spirit over in the Bible. Will not let you use hold that on, word. hold on, listen. The you don't, Spirit of God will listen. let you use that word. Okay? The Spirit of God. The right. Holy Spirit. Hold on, hold on. I don't want to get into a ramble. You know the Spirit of God? Hold on, I don't want to get into a ramble. You're telling me why am I doing something? I ask you a the question. Holy Spirit. Hold on. Listen we have to, to be other. able to talk. Get our ears. Okay. If you tell me why am I doing something, and then your answer is Jesus Christ, you have to show me in the Bible, right? Because because you, you you believe in God, right? You believe in Christ well, as well, I was right? Would you want to keep me? Would you want? Would when you I'm, want me? Well, to, let me talk, finish what I'm saying. I just need a yes or no. You ask me a question. Let me finish what I'm saying. It's just a yes or no. You ask me. <laughs> I know Jesus Christ. I would dedicate to the Lord when I was a year old. I was baptized in the Holy Ghost. Uh, listen, I listen, I, I know, but look, you're okay. trying to tell your, your biography. That's fine. But that's not what we're dealing with right now. We're just dealing with understanding where each other's coming from. Right? So so this is just a simple yes or no. Do you believe in God and do you believe in Christ? All the way. Okay, you do. 100%. You ask me why am I using the word hell? I'm not talking like who? Christ. Right? He's in you, right? Show me in the Bible he's where the you, word right? hell, right? If he's in you, you're not no, going to say no, the word we're hell. Not, we're not. Listen, <laughs> show me in the. <laughs> a couple times. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> like, it's, it's, it's weird. You don't see that weird? Well, you're going to. You're saying don't use the word hell, but you're freely saying the word hell. No, you're saying, I'm just repeating what you were saying. Okay. Now have show me in natural, the Bible. Have your natural. Show me in the Bible why I can't say hell. Show me where it says saying the word hell is bad. It's a sin. It's something you shouldn't do. Have you ever read the book of Proverbs? Show me in the Bible. Do you read the book of Proverbs? I don't, listen, I don't know that verse, so I'm asking you to give me that verse. You're telling me to go read a whole book to find one verse that you vehemently believe There's is no in the Bible. Bible. Okay. You what, know that word. Whatever got you what into is, believing this way. Come on, man. You it's keep going on. Why you don't want to answer questions? I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to have a battle of nothingness. Because I want to share. You know what, you know what this? I want to share logical thoughts. Upon is hate. 
No, listen. It's based on to, me, dude. You have to, you have to follow the Bible. You should read the I Bible. I followed the Bible my whole no, life. No, 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 because you're speaking from the heart. You're not speaking from the Bible. You know, you're not giving me biblical verses or something that I'm doing wrong. Things. You're actually just over talking me when the Bible says don't interrupt the man in the midst of his speech. Right? So what is sin? Who is love? What is sin? Who is love? Come on, man. I mean, listen, Tell me I can talk to you, this. but let me finish with this man. Tell me who loves Right? Y'all know each other? No. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Do you know okay. God is love? I, I thought he was bored and just hey, like, you know what I mean? Do you know God is love? Listen. Right? right? Tell me what is God love? Is love. What is love? Exactly. You dumbass motherfucker. All right, so. It's God. <laughs> Come on, man. Listen. Hey, God is read, love. Listen, you know. We will deal with some of your God things. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you with the Bible, okay? Because you obviously just Jesus talking, Christ? right? Listen, you just want to ask how many Christ? questions you got, Big Bear? Who is Jesus Christ? Come on, man. Let's go. Let's go. Shutting each other down. Well, who is Christ? Like... Tell me. I don't know. I'm up here with all these signs with the Bible. I don't know who Christ is. You don't Tell me. Tell me, man. The What's your name? God. The Son of God. Son of God. That's 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 it. Right? Did he have an earthly father? Like Did Christ have an earthly father? Did Christ have an earthly father? Joseph. <laughs> right. That yeah, was look, not his look, real. Look, look, it was not what? No, he was he was impregnated by the Holy Ghost. Jesus Christ. <laughs> We don't know what Bible you reading, bro. <laughs> no, Mary, I'm gonna deal with Mary, Mary, right here. Mary we, was impregnated. We'll deal with you in a Ghost. second, man. All right, we'll deal Mary with you was impregnated by oh, the Holy Ghost. What's your name, man? Mary was impregnated by well, the Holy Ghost. Why are you Ghost. like my this, name is man? John, John James. All That's right. My name. No, no, thank you, man. We, yeah, please. Sons of Thunder. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter name. 17. And really, nigga? Verse 9. The heart is deceitful above all things. The heart is deceitful above all things. Our, that's la'ab in the Hebrew. That's our mind, right? Because a lot of these things and a lot of these concepts and a lot of these feelings that we get literally come from other people, right? They don't come, they don't come from no, they, they don't come from anything else, right? Somebody is okay with taking a custom and, and believing in some type of moral value from something the guy said 10 years ago, right? but then they will discredit something that was written thousands of years ago, yeah. 600 years ago, yeah, right? And, and so, uh, my, my question one second, I got one more thing for him, right? We're going to deal with you, right? Sure. Right? Because you, you're going to be here, right? I'm trying to be respectful. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Look, Everyone. He's not being respectful, but I just want to just deal with one thing real quick, right? Because this man doesn't have any biblical verses. He's just talking. This is what pastors do at the church, right? Go ahead. It's the book of 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 and verse 21. Prove all things. Hold fast that... What did it say? Prove all things. John James, go ahead. Hold fast that which is good. Prove all things, man. Yeah. Yeah. Prove it through the word of God then. Stop just telling us. Don't, don't ask us why we're doing something. Listen, that's the only thing you know. No, we're, you, you're, you keep saying it as if we disagree. No, it's not, that's not the only Listen, thing you keep saying it as if we disagree. Why do you keep saying that? Because it's based upon love. <laughs> and what is love? It's God. You don't even know what love God is. God is love. I got that for you. you got God it. is love. It's the book of First John. Chapter God so loved the world we, that he gave us only We're going to show you son. love. There's the book of 1 John. You're talking over the Bible. You're talking over the Bible, man. You're talking over the Bible, man. Come on, man. You out here hey, dressed like a failed actor. Don't deny Come on, man. It's the book of 1 John, chapter 5 and verse 3. For this is the love of God. Oh, this is the love of God, black Latinos and Native Americans. It's not what you think it is in the world. Because I can line up 10 different people, and I can ask them what love is, and they're going to they're going to say something different. They're going to have a different opinion about love. He's God, right? The Bible God is, not is putting us He's all spirit. on one page on what love is. God is so when 10 of us line up and we're asked what is love, everybody has the same answer. God is spirit. That's, 
that's how love should be. Love shouldn't be confusing that I have to love somebody according to the way they want to be loved. Love should just have a standard. Right? And that's what the Bible is doing, right? You're not going to talk over me. You're not good enough. Go ahead. Look at 1 John chapter 5 and verse 3. Bring it out. For this is the love of God. Right. That we keep his commandments. That we what? That we keep his commandments. What is love? That we keep his commandments. No, what is love? For God so loved the world that he gave us For this is the love of God that we keep his commandments. That we right? It's not As telling us what he is saying, okay. which is nothing. Keep reading. For this for is the love of God. The world, then, for this is the love of God. God. Right? What's more powerful than loving like the Most High God? Go ahead. That we keep his commandments, and his commandments are not grievous. And the commandments are not grievous. The commandments are not hard. Right? Go ahead. It's the book of Matthew, chapter 15, and verse 24. But he answered and said, I am not sent. But what? unto but the, the lost sheep, sheep of the house of Israel. Israel. No, I was sent to everybody. I am I not, not sent, but, but unto the lost, lost sheep of the house of Israel. Israel. This Nicholas Cage reject right here. I am not sent, but yeah. unto the lost, lost sheep of the, the house, house of Israel. Israel. Yeah, so guy who don't know the Bible, who has not read the Bible, who has come up here and not been able to prove anything in the Bible, right? For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten Son, listen. that whosoever believes in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Okay? Right? That's all I need Good. to say. Wait, hold on. 316. Listen. What is the world? God is love. What is the world he in that verse? Only son what world to is that verse? To sacrifice himself and okay. through the blood of Jesus Christ, me, um, you are set free from sin and iniquity, from all darkness. Right. Through the blood that uh -huh. Jesus shed at Calvary. How many worlds are there? You free from sin listen, man. And listen, iniquity. you're listen, listen. listen. Are you divorced? You have to accept that sacrifice that Jesus made at Calvary. Hey, listen. If you don't accept that, then you're listen, going to hell. Listen, you, listen. You need Period. to understand. Let me tell you oh, how I confusing this guy is, right? I understand. What this guy is rebuking. Is Jesus Christ. This guy is rebuking. Jesus Christ. Just to, the just to the say something. The life. You're saying Period. something just to say something. He shed man. his blood for you. Listen. And for you. We know and that you. he did not shed you. it for you, though. That's right. You don't know you that. We know he shed it for us, but he didn't. Shed it for you. He said it. He shed it for you that you'd be set free. What is sin? Ah, it's iniquity. It's a, and what is iniquity? Against God. And what's against God? What's yeah, against you're gonna have God? to get to the answer, God is brother. Perfect. God is perfect. I said, what is against God? Is God? What is against so God? Against okay, so God? how do you not be perfect the to God? The devil is against God. Listen okay. to the question. How do you not be perfect to God? How do you the blood create of Jesus an Christ? No, no. I said Set not be perfect. Not you be cannot perfect. Cannot be perfect. What? Oh, what? In Christ. You can't? Only through Jesus Christ. Oh my gosh. Through can I get in you? Can I get to be perfect, uh, please? Okay. Right? And the only way of being Listen, perfect hold is through on. Jesus you, Christ. You said Who's we can't be perfect. You said we can't be perfect. Only through Christ. Okay. Right? He, was, he was the sacrifice. This is the book of Matthew, God. chapter 5, and verse 48. Uh -huh. Be ye therefore perfect. What? Be, be ye therefore perfect. Oh, well, we're told in to Christ. be perfect. In Christ. Listen. And through Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. Even as your Father, Christ. which is in heaven, is perfect. Through Christ. Re listen. Listen. Only through Christ. Listen to what it's perfect. saying. Li listen to what it's saying. It's only through Christ. Stop. Perfect. Get out your head, bro. This is the book of Matthew, chapter you know 5, what? and verse 48. Listen. listen. Be ye therefore be perfect. Okay. So it's saying, be ye there perfect. Hey. This is a this is a statement, right? Jesus there, we're being told to be perfect, not try to be, not if you can be, we're told to be perfect. Go ahead. Even as your father which is in heaven is perfect. It didn't say through Christ. To serve the Lord Jesus Christ with all his heart. It didn't say through Christ. Hold on, don't go nowhere, man. We're about to end this. Right? It didn't, it didn't say through Christ. Go ahead. It said through what? It said like what? Even as your Father which is in heaven is perfect. It said be perfect like our Father in heaven is perfect, man. It didn't say. Christ. It didn't say through Jesus. Christ. Listen. 
is the, Jesus the price he paid at Calvary does, to what he does did Je is Jesus and God the same person us as people is Jesus and God the same Jesus person did. I know what this guy is the I know what this guy is the Holy Ghost he's the guy one. that's mad that he hasn't read the Bible and that you have these little black and Latino thug-looking you know dudes up here you know who have devoted their life to following the Most you know High God knows? and who are maybe 20 years younger Jesus than him, you, right? Brother. But we Jesus have so much so more much. wisdom than him, right? Go ahead. Jesus loves you so it's the book of First John. You don't have to tell me that. I know he loves me. What we're out here so to much. say is he doesn't love you. Right. Right. It's the book of First John. I can prove that he doesn't love you. I can prove that. Really? Can you prove that God loves you? I know for a fact. Okay, show me in the Bible that God loves you. That God loves you. Show me. Because I received Christ as a child. Do you eat pork? Do you eat pork? Oh, uh, look, you ready to lie already? Be ready to commit two sins in five seconds. He said he just right? Yeah, right? You eat shrimp, lobster? You eat shrimp, lobster? No, I, don't, I don't like lobster. It's cockroach. Okay, okay. But you eat pork. Yeah, I eat some pork. All right. So, can we eat pork? Jesus came to obscure the law. He said he took that away when he paid the price of the cow. You sure? Yeah. There's the book of 1 John, chapter 3 and verse 8. He that committed sin is of the devil. He that committed sin is of the what? He that he committed, committed sin, sin is, is of, of the, the devil. Man, deceivers, Christ. deceivers, right? right. Now, now, yeah, oh, you hold are. on, there's more on that, right? You are. For the devil sinned from the beginning. The devil sinned from the beginning. You've never kept the commandments, bro. You're the devil. You've never kept the commandments. You've been eating pork all your life, right? Who do you think fell for You've been gold? eating pork all your life? What? You've been eating pork all your life? Right. You haven't kept the commandments from what? The devil what? He that committed sin is of the devil. Uh-huh. For the devil hey. sinned from the beginning. Hey. From the beginning. I eat spiritual food. Listen, okay. I eat spiritual food. I know. It's the book of Matthew, Matthew chapter 5, Jesus verse 17. Alright, he said, slack you. He said, he said Christ Man came. When Christ came, you didn't have to keep the commandments. That's basically what Man he was saying. Let's look at Matthew chapter 5, verse 17. Think not that I am come to destroy the law. Uh-oh. Christ said, think not that I've come to destroy the law. What is the law? Grace and mercy. What is the law? Grace and mercy. What is the law? No, that can't be the law. It's what Christ. is the law? Where is, is where is the law found in the Bible? Christ is grace. I'm mercy. asking you a question. Christ and mercy. Where in the Bible does it say where we are instructed, where we can find the laws of God? Where? Dude, you need to Exactly. <laughs> you are an idiot. <laughs> You don't know where to find the laws of God, but you swear I need to pray. Go ahead. Think not that I am come to destroy the law or the prophets. Or the prophets. Think not. This is Christ's words, man. The man that you are up here vehemently praising, right, and worshiping. He is saying, listen to what he's saying then. Listen to what he's saying then, man. Every okay, day. then listen to I'm what he's saying. Think not that I'm come to destroy the law or the prophets. Or the prophets. The law or the prophets. Go ahead. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. I've come not to destroy, but fulfill. Right? So let me tell you something. Right? If Christ was coming to destroy the law, then that means you don't have to keep the law. But he said he's he not coming to, to destroy it. it. Fulfill, fulfill the law. Right. What did Christ fulfill? He fulfilled the law. What did he Through fulfill? His price at Calvary. So how how did he fulfill the law? His blood. He fulfilled the law by shedding his blood. Right. Now we was was hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. The old is gone, the new is hold gone. Hold on. Through Christ right? Jesus. Christ came to fulfill the law, right? And the new old is gone, the new has come. So the New Testament is is pretty much what we're dealing with, right? 
It's the book of Acts, chapter 3 and verse 18. But those things which God before had showed by the mouth of all his prophets, that Christ should suffer, that Christ should suffer, right? So when Christ says, I've come to fulfill the law, Christ came here, he had a duty. He was already programmed and designed to be sacrificed Program? and to be sacrificed, right? Go ahead. But those things which God before had showed by the mouth of all his prophets that Christ should suffer, he had so fulfilled. He so had fulfilled, right? Listen, man, you get that stinky finger out of our face, man. What are you doing, man? Listen, listen, and you're going to be destroyed by the God Almighty, confess You're going to be destroyed. You're just a rambler. What Bible verse is that? What Bible verse is that? What verse is that? What verse is that? Jesus Christ is Lord. What verse is that, Nicholas Cage? God the Go ahead. Father. Your knees right. gonna this book bow. of Matthew, chapter 19, Your knees verse 16. Bow. Your knees gonna and behold, bow. one came and said bow. unto him, uh -huh. Good Master, right. what good thing shall I do that I may bow. have eternal Jesus life? Jesus that I may have eternal life, right? This is something we all want. You eternal life, right? Eternity so now there's a question being asked, what do I get for eternal I'll life? Go right ahead. Now. You and don't want to spend him, eternity Why callest hell, thou me good? Period. There is none good but one. Go there, There's none good. Okay. There's none good but one. Hell There's is none for good but angels. one. Are you a good Falling man? Falling angels are, is for hell. You don't hey, want to go there. I want every kid. You're going to burn an and eternal fire. To look right, over guys, here. You're going to burn don't an do eternal drugs. fire. Don't do drugs. Okay. All right. Don't, you, don't do drugs, y'all. You the truth, you're gonna be out here with your dumb hat and your man boots, and you're gonna be yelling at youngsters. No sorry. All right. <laughs> Fix your shirt. It ain't even tucked in right. All right. And them sandals stink. Hey. Okay. From the devil. Take it easy. Hey. No, you are the yeah. devil. Right. <laughs> you're a deceiver, bro. Right. What does from devil mean? Hell, brother. What does devil mean? You know the devil will use. I'm not your brother. Don't call me that, man. Hey. You What's better, the devil? You better repent of your sins. You right better now. fix your nose. Repent. <laughs> repent. You better fix your nose, man. Is at hand. Fix your nose. The kingdom of God is at hand. Fix your nose. Repent. Fix your nose. Repent. Hey, listen. Take repent. some of that pension. Fix the rest repent. of the team on the left side. Repent. Or you're going to go to hell. After you do that, right? After you do that, fix your five o'clock shadow. It looks stupid. <laughs> All right? Can you hear me? All right? Down? Am I putting you down? Take it easy. You take it easy, man. Hey, go read the Bible again, all right? And hey, just to let you know, you want to do lateral push-ups for those man boobs. <laughs> you want to do about three sets of ten, all right? I'll be back. <laughs>